Hey and welcome back to another episode of Just Call Me Josie and in today's video I am, upon request, recreating the eye look that I wore in my Panda Palette Finale. So I am of course using the Urban Decay and Gwen Stefani palette, but you can use whatever shadows you have laying around at home. So this is my go-to glam eye look for any occasion if I want to look like I tried but I don't have enough time to, let's say, do winged eyeliner or a proper cut crease. So this is sort of my quick, fast, easy and a little bit of a cheat into a cut crease. So first and foremost, very important, I put down my primer. This is the Fenty Pro Filter Primer and this is by far the best primer that I have ever tried. Next I went in with the shade Star, which is a very light tan shade and I put that down as a transition shade all over my crease. After that I went in with the shade Anaheim, which is a cool tone brown shade and I put that into my actual crease and just blended that through. Next I went in with the shade Punk, which is a really deep shade and I put that on my outer corner to create some depth. I blend this one a little bit inwards towards my eyelid, covering about one third of the eyelid. I would say. And now it is of course time for the star of the show which is the Cila Glittering Glow in the shade Kitten Karma. You don't have to use this particular eyeshadow by any means, there are plenty of dupes out there but it is key that you use a liquid eyeshadow that has a doe foot applicator. So I hold the applicator like this and I place it right at the top of my fold or where my natural fold begins I would say in my crease like this and then I just follow the natural curve of my eye and then I just proceed to fill in the entire eyelid that is left. Once I've done that I go back in with the brush that I use for the dark shade Punk right here and I start to blend those two together by just sweeping it across like this right at the edge where the two meet so we don't get a super stark line right there. And then to clean that up, if it got a little messy, I take a small pencil brush with one of the shades in my crease and I just trace that lightly all along this cut creasy line to make it look even sharper. I went back in with the shade Punk and the pencil brush on my lower lash line just to define that. And I also blended it out a little bit with the shade Anaheim. And for the last finishing touches I took this highlighter shade called Blonde and I put that on my inner corner quite a bit because I do like a bright inner corner. So that is it for my go-to glam eye look. Hopefully that was easy enough to follow along with. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up before you go and also do feel free to subscribe. I upload a lot of reviews and product pans, shop my stash, declutters and tutorials as well. So definitely feel free to stick around and I will see you guys in my next video. Take care until then. Bye!